seven key aspects why and when you need to register your business. Welcome to our regular podcast on doing business in Cambodia. My name is Kim Zupat Kung. I am the CEO of Making It Easy Cambodia. Our podcast today is about why and when you need to register your business in Cambodia. Uh, maybe some of you are in the state that you are doing business or maybe in the process to do business and you are questioning yourself, should I register your business, my business? Should I not registering my business? So my podcast today is about seven key aspects why and when you need to register your business. Number one, you need to register your business in Cambodia because it is required by the commercial and taxation law. It's a must. It's not the option. It's not your choice. You are in Cambodia, you do business in Cambodia, so it's a must to register your business in Cambodia. By the commercial and taxation law, you have to register your business after you start generating revenue for 15 days. It means that after 15 days of collecting money, you need to register. That's number one. Number two, you need to register your business in Cambodia because you need to be compliant, you need to uh, follow the law, you need to be legalized, you need to be liable in the public and those you serve. Because if you are not registered, you are not by law yet. And you are not following the law, you are not liable to the people you serve, especially the customer and your partner. So number three, you need to register your business in Cambodia because you want to build trust with the people you serve, especially your client and your corporate client. If you are providing the service or the product to the corporate client, it means that they have registered their business already. They often check if your company is registered or not. If your business is not registered yet, they might say no to work with you, so you miss the opportunity. Number four, why you need to register your business in Cambodia? You need to register your business in Cambodia because... Are you a foreigner looking to expand your business in Cambodia? At Making It Easy, we specialize in helping you to navigate the complexities of doing business in the kingdom. Here what we offer. Register and close business or NGO. Tax compliant. Business address. And business compliant consultancy. Stop stressing about doing business in Cambodia. Contact us now for the assistance. It ends about you to issue tax invoice to your client uh, and you can also claim the what back. It's a benefit two ways. You uh, have the right to issue tax invoice to your corporate client when you are selling product or service to B2B. You can also claim the what back. So actually in that sense, they, they have the system like what in, what out, offset. So, no one is paying tax actually because you collect 10% what from your client, you claim it back. And the client can also claim the what back as well. So that's reason number four. Reason number five, why you need to register your business in Cambodia? Because it's the opportunity for you to collaborate with other potential partners and especially investors. If your business is not registered, those partners and investors will not work with you, especially if you like to extend the collaboration across the border. Reason number six, why you need to register your business in Cambodia? Because you might want to get access to any grants, the public grants, the government grants, the grant from international organization and other kind of incentive provided by the government. So if you are not registered, you cannot get access to that. Seven. Last but not least, you register your business in Cambodia because you want to build a reputable, sustainable brand and name of the company. So if your business is not registered, 
it is not yours. The name is not yours. The brand is not yours. So once you have registered your, your business in Cambodia, especially if you registered it, it as a private limited company, the name of your company lasts for 99 years, renewable. It means that no one else can take that name. And especially if you also register your trademark, uh, you are using your trademark exclusively for 10 years renewable. So uh, the last point, point is very important. If you want to do sustainable long-term business, the brand name, the name of the company is very important. So register to protect your exclusive rights. To stay tuned with our regular uh, podcast on doing business in Cambodia, please follow or like or subscribe uh, to our social medias. Thank you. Making it easy, your trusted partner.